When President Kennedy announced dramatically in 1961 that America would send a man to the moon before the end of the decade, what were his emotions? Because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills. Because that challenge is one that we're willing to accept. This emotional decoding came from a computer program developed by Dr. Yoram Levinon, founder and CEO of Israeli company X Audios. Dr. Levinon began his work on identifying emotional states through the voice by asking how even newborn babies can feel our emotions so clearly. He can't look at you, he just can listen. My way of thinking was that the intonation is the secret. So Dr. Levinon analyzed over 50,000 voice samples in many languages. It doesn't matter if it's in English, in Hebrew or French. I love you. I love you. If you can uh, just listen to the intonation, that you will understand that's a love. And how many emotions are in his emotional lexicon? In the beginning, it was only 12 emotions, but that only was the beginning. Right now, we can uh, find uh, more than 400 sorts of emotions. He was happy to show me one of his programs in action. You can see that I'm excited because I'm talking about my work. I want to express myself, maybe I... Uh, okay, let's see. The system is telling you that I'm right now filled with happy and or loving emotions. I feel the need to lead according to my inner belief. Xaudio supplied its technology and a product it developed for call centers called Maginify which is already used by companies in the U.S. and Israel. Maginify analyzes both the customer's and the agent's voice in real time and gives suggestions to the agent during the call, for example, to be more positive in the conversation. Supervisors can also use Maginify to monitor agents' performances in real time. Levels of patronizing or aggressiveness are measured in the voice of each agent. So we see that agent three, his sales score is just all right, it's yellow. Red patronizing levels are very high, too patronizing, and his aggressiveness levels are okay. Exaudio says the products can save both customers and companies money. After Lebanon found that his programs were only about 80% accurate, he uncovered another surprising factor. Our voices are influenced by certain diseases, including heart disease, cancer, Parkinson's, and even autism. Using Exaudio software, a study at the Weizmann Institute of Science in Israel correctly identified 85% of mildly autistic children. Lebanon can sometimes even identify the severity of a disease. There is a correlation between the spectrum and the magnitude of the Parkinson disease. Turning his attention in a totally new direction, Levinon says in the future, X Audios might begin work on an emotional search engine. Google can say something about uh, if you are uh, asking for uh, love songs, for example, you will get the information. But if I'm talking about love songs and I'm desperate, the system will look for the uh, love song which are fitted to a man in desperate.